What's good, YouTube? I know it has been a while, but I am back. Blockchain Subs are back here with you. In today's video, or maybe in this weekend's video rather, y'all gonna join me in a 72 hour trip, a little less than that, trip to Tampa. Quick life update here. I'm recently fun employed. I feel like I'm still processing it. I don't know how to feel about it. However, I said all of my trips must go on. I made sure of that. I was like, listen, like if I'm gonna have to deal with this, like I know a lot of other people are dealing with, I'm gonna make sure I have fun with it. So I'm gonna be bringing out a lot more content. I wrote down a list of a lot of things that I wanted to do in my life. And I was like, you know what? I haven't had time like this in a while. Like the last time I had time like this to just sit down and think and ponder is probably like in college. And even then is like, you're so focused on work and internships and all of that. So I figured in today's video, I'm gonna bring y'all along on my trip to Tampa. With that being said, I'm gonna try my best to do it on a budget because we do have to be smart with our bread. But other than that, I'm gonna take y'all on this trip. Let's see if we can make this shit super fun, super lit but still be on a budget. And if so, I'm gonna upload it and show y'all how much I spent throughout my entire weekend. So let's go ahead, enough talking, go ahead and do it. We are on the road on the way to Hartsfield. So I live about, I would say probably 30 minutes with traffic from Hartsfield, as y'all can see. However, I don't know why I always do this to myself though. I like to be giving myself travel anxiety, right? It's like, because I know I live so close to the airport with traffic, I'd be like, let me leave like right on the dot. And that shit always comes to bite me in the ass whenever I have a checked bag, so. Today, I paid for a checked bag. I did bring a carry-on, so I don't know if I'm gonna use that checked bag. Preferably, I would like to, that way I not have to drag it through the airport. However, I do have a few liquids that are, that are slightly over 20, or slightly over three ounces. So, we'll see what happens. Hopefully, uh, we make it on time, but it says 28 minutes. I also do have to go park my car first, so that's gonna take a little bit of time, but we'll see. Shit, wish me luck. <laughs> Ow, what? Hopefully I didn't get a flat from that shit, bro. I'd be so tight on my way to the airport. Just all these different curveballs. Like, they don't want me to go on this trip. But yeah, uh, 20 minutes, so we're gonna see what's up, y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and turn this off just so I can focus on driving. But yeah, on that note, I'll be back. I'll be back. Quick time check. So we got 19 minutes. 12.39, my flight departs at 2.12 p.m. So I know I'm gonna make it in time, it's just more so can I be able to check my bag. I don't wanna have to throw out my liquids that I have. I only have like two this time, because I made sure last time I threw out like $50 worth of liquid. So I was pretty sick about that, but I'm gonna take my time and be safe. But cross fingers, hope I can get my checked bag and the pass for the checked bag in time. But yeah, I'll update y'all once I get to the parking and hopefully that flies by. All right, y'all, we just made it. We just made it to the parking. Thank goodness, bro. I'm over here stressing. It is 12.41 right now. I think the shuttle is coming, so I'm gonna just get my stuff out the car. And I think we should be lit. Hopefully they don't have to pick up too many other people. Cause if not, then we probably might not be able to check this bag. But man, I'm staying in good spirits, bro. I'm speaking this into existence. We're gonna check this bag today. I just need to get my ear pods and be straight. Oh no, he's leaving me. Oh hell no. Where is he going to? All right, y'all, let's get the ear pods and then wait for the shuttle. We somewhere over here. Bring your ass over here, bro. He bugging trying to leave me. All right, everything close. Oh wow, the shuttle left me? That's wild. That's wild. There's one right there. One right there, but like, bro, where's the shuttle at? I'm gonna just walk up there though, for real. And then just send them my picture of my ticket. But I'll be right back, let's do this. 
just touched down it is approximately 12 58 so we about to see if we can make it in here i think we have time because my flight departs at 2 12 and usually 45 minutes so that's hard no kids faces in the camera but that bag is hard got a little baby on that got some fire bags today american flag bag is tough there's a lot of people in here today sheesh i think i could check in over there yeah it's just carry on only and carry on and wait made it in time she just blessed because i was about to wait on this no line. not doing that sky priority where are you at oh, okay it's over there on that side i see it she just saved me a long ass line now i could go chill man i need to keep my status for sure that is for sure and i could have checked my bag here too that's crazy enter here let's go how you doing i'm doing good yep i thought it'd been more hectic than this it was a labor day weekend oh it was okay all right thank you you too and we are good we checked in, no panic. It's 109 and we good. I made it through. I was really panicking for a second, which is kind of crazy. One of my rituals, even though I know this is real close, it's 8-3, I always need to make sure I see the gate before I just calm down. So gotta make sure we get to our gate real quick. Am I about to miss this train? I think I could walk to Concourse A. No, I can't. We gotta go. It's only one stop though. Next train comes in 53 minutes. So. 53. We almost there. Alright, just made it to A. Just gotta take the escalator up. The A gates. Gotta go left. Man, I really do miss JFK sometimes. The food options is just way better. Like by a thousand percent, way better. It's like, what is a food bar? But yeah, A1, uh, flights at 2.12. Oh, this is like the very last gate. Damn. I just want to confirm that my gate is there and that my flight is boarding there. Because sometimes they'll change it. So, oh, is that my hometown that I see? Oh, yeah, I can't see it from here, but... I'll be going there in two weeks, my hometown. But I'm not bored in that though. I miss it. I'll be there in two weeks though, but it's interesting the different options. Sweetwater. I feel like this is a sign for me to go home soon. Cause look, another flight to my hometown. But this one's at 3.44 though. Another one. Another one. Yeah, I'll be home soon. Mom, if you're watching, I'll be home soon. But yeah, I feel like that's a sign. I've been trying to move my flight up and running into issues where it's like 50 or $60 more. Like I told y'all, we fun employed now. So I'm not about to be frivolously spending money like I used to, maybe. But nonetheless, I'm still gonna have fun with it. I'm not gonna let it hold me down. Some people do let them hold me down. But yeah, nonetheless, I think I see Tampa, A5, for Indianapolis. Who goes to Indianapolis? This gate is mad empty. And then we got Richmond, Dallas. Been to Dallas once. I wonder what time my flight board's at. Let's see. But we almost there. Just wanna make sure. And I'll probably get a nice little snack for myself. We here. Let me move out of everybody's way. But cool, my gate exists. I don't really gotta worry anymore. I'm chilling and it's 133 flight leaves at 212 so 15 that means doors close at 150 20 minutes i better get something to eat be right back just landed in tampa we're about to get to it, it i already feel the humidity i'm like well, i do feel that already going up why she sound like that this definitely looks like a new airport it's mad nice i'll say it's nicer than hartsfield in terms of like amenities it does look mad nice though big ass flamingo i should go get a picture in front of it but yeah and they got like all these little stores 
and obviously Chick-fil-A, but trying to figure out where to catch this Uber Lyft at. Cause it told me to come back up here and I just came from here, from the gates, I'm trying to figure out where do I go. Looks like it's sending me back into the terminal, but I finally found it. Like what? Yo, I had to come down the escalator and another elevator and I'm like, where am I going? I had no idea, but just called the XL. It's picking me up in a caravan, but yeah, I'm ready to just go sit down for a second. I'm tired, bro. It's like a 30 minute ride to where I'm at. Look like we're gonna be in a mix, but fuck it. It is mad humid. Compared to Atlanta though, I'll say it's mad humid. So, so far we are paying $29.22. So here we go, we starting it. I have these glasses on, it's demon time. <laughs> yeah, I'm really bugging. What Quay said, he said, we disciples, we're not demons. So when I have these glasses on, I'm a disciple. <sighs> oh, so. Yeah, you got it right. <laughs> Here I am. Man. All right, y'all just touched down. We made it to the BMP. Nah, this shit kind of fire. If I had to set up a BB, I'll definitely set it up like this. Got the foosball. It's a nice little setup. I must say, would love if they had a bedroom though, but it's all right, you know? We're not really gonna be inside too much, so. I'm just trying to charge this battery real quick and then go outside, get something to eat. But yeah, Uber driver told me about this place, this pizza place, and it's actually on the map called Do Amico's Pizza. He said the water was imported from New York. So we about to see if he's actually telling the truth to see if this water is actually imported from New York, but I'm starving. I'm about to go up there with the camera. It's like a five minute walk. So I'm about to take y'all with me real quick and we about to bust this pizza down because I miss having pizza. It's been a while since I've been in New York, as y'all know. And Atlanta doesn't have a good pizza. Whoever doesn't feel that way, fight me. I don't care. But yeah, we're about to get some food real quick. I don't know, man. Camera fogged up. Nah, over here looks like a vibe, but we still waiting on Brodo. We're not about to do anything without him. Yeah. This place reminds me of like New Orleans, but a little bit cleaner. Just like slightly bit. I'm recording this shit for my safety because I really don't know this person. Where you from? I live here. You live here? Yeah. You mind if I just call it for a bit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just go ahead and figure it out. But you got to leave before the end of tonight, though. Okay. Or else I'm going to call the cops. Before the end of tonight. Got it. Right. Nah, this is really crazy. There's a whole nigga in my crib. You want a drink or something? Like, nah, this is really crazy. I don't know who this is. Like, I told y'all we went to Yarbor earlier. Yeah. And we walked the strip and shit. But I don't know who this nigga is. It's a dope crib. You got here, man. Yeah, I appreciate it. Pleasure. Oh, you vlog too? Yeah, something like that. I'll be on YouTube. Yeah, okay. you on YouTube? Yeah, I'm on YouTube. Oh, where? Look me up. All right. Yo, nice to meet you, chat. Hey, what's up, chat? I hope you're not live streaming or nothing like that. I'm not into that. You know what's funny? When I was coming back here yeah. from the strip, yeah. my Uber driver asked me the same thing. He's like, <laughs> are you live streaming? I said, nah. <laughs> He said, like, I'm just trying to make sure I'm, for my safety. I said, all right, bro. I said, what if I make you rich? Yeah. He says, well, you got to cut me a check. He's <laughs> like, I know where you live. I was like, you saving the dresses off of Lyft and you Uber now? That shit yeah. is crazy. Yeah, where are you from? You don't mind me asking. Uh, I came from LA. Oh, okay. LA. Yeah. The streets though, like Compton. Oh uh, shit, yeah, I'm about to actually leave. Oh. For real? Yeah. Can I keep the water though? Yeah, you can take the water. You okay. got to leave though. They can say he'll play before or say less. All right, I'm with it. I'm gonna play. We about game. to play. We about to play for the spot. Yeah. So if I lose, then I gotta leave my crib and give it to this random person that does YouTube. Yeah. Or says he does YouTube. But if I win, he has to leave and give me my water back. All right, niggas playing for access to the crib. Bet foosball for the crib. See, I wish this was a pool table because I don't do this foosball shit. <laughs> with it. You know, this shit. First to 10. Bet. I'll try to cheat now. <laughs> <laughs> That's one zip. Oh! <laughs> That's one one. I hope y'all paying attention, man. Five minutes later. <laughs> Yo, why does it keep rolling over here? What the fuck? Ah, let's go. <laughs> was it one more? One. One, one ten. More. I'm this, this is my house. I'm getting smoked, y'all. This is my house. Nah, 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 I can't end like that. It's crazy. 
This shit definitely mops out. This side, we ain't gonna make excuses. Ah, no! Ah. What was that? Oh, you go. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. This is my chat now. Yes. Yo, what's up, chat? So I'm Blockchain Sosa. Uh, this is my channel. Thanks for uh, doing all the things and subscribe below and all that. Make sure y'all, you know, subscribe and do all that and Yo, give me subs. This shit rig. Yeah, so tap into uh, Zami with a Z, not an S. You know what I'm saying? Rig. Who is Zami? Everyone on YouTube, rig. all that. This is my chat now. <laughs> my, my new chat. Say what's up to my, my, my old chat. So we in Florida, right? And you know, they, all these niggas vote red. Now I'm not trying to be political, but then <laughs> you go ahead and figure that out for yourself. All these uh, niggas vote red. The red nigga wins? Come on now. Niggas cheating, bro. Can be telling you my YouTube channel if you're not gonna subscribe. Come on now. When I was vlogging in the airport, yeah. and one of the security dudes asked me, like, yo, you vlog or you got YouTube, whatever. I'm like, yeah, I'll spit it real quick. Yo, yeah. it's this, that, and the third. It's real simple. It's Z-A-M-M-Y, blah, And then he like, I'm a subscriber. I'm a support, blah, blah, blah. And like, this is when I had less than a thousand. So I'm like, I'm checking every subscriber. I'm yep. like, I ain't getting no subscribers. <laughs> this nigga chat, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, why say you go subscribe? You could have just been like, yeah, I'll check your channel out. Yeah. You don't have to even lie like that. No view, nothing. Like, that shit just stayed the same. Nothing on the Look bar graph. Like, damn, bro, I ain't, ain't nothing. How does shit compare to, like, LA in terms of um, weather? Um, so I could definitely, like, I could feel the humidity. Like, it's not, it's not OD. Yeah. Honestly, it feels, nighttime feels a little better. There's like a breeze, bro. Yeah, no breeze in Atlanta either. This shit just be hot and humid, like. <laughs> Be like, yo, when is this shit gonna cool down? Like, nah, that's a fact. That shit, the sun be out, bro. That shit be like, it feel like I'm in like an air fryer. <laughs> the way that they shit, can say air no fryer. Just, sun just baking your skin, like you can feel it just yeah. like sizzling. No amount of like sunscreen, none of that is gonna help. The worst be like when you get in your car and it's like, yo, like the AC just don't work. It's that hot, like. Should be happening a lot in Atlanta. I'm like, God damn, this shit is hot. Like, yeah, it's nice time. We out here though. We finna grab some food and something. Nah, this place remind me of um, Glendale. Like just the Greekness of it. Like, don't get me wrong. I love Atlanta, but I'm like, yo, I need variation. Like, it's just straight white and black. And the worst comes with the food, and that's why I'm like always like, yeah, Atlanta food mid, because like that's how I judge a city off of food. Yeah. Cause it's like you got everything in New York food wise, so it's like if your food not busting, I don't want to live there. Like that's just how it is. Yeah, food man. not busting, I don't want to live there. In New York pizza, nah. <laughs> I tried is it though. Yeah, <laughs> that shit was busting out. I'm gonna lie. Okay. Like, all right, this is my honest review. It doesn't compare to New York pizza, but you could tell that they imported the water from New York here. That's what my Uber driver said. And I was like, all right, but they don't got the brick oven though. Uh, That's the thing. You need the brick oven. oven. All right, I'm gonna set expectations right now. What? Seven out of ten. Seven, seven out of ten. Yeah. Right. Like if it was two a.m., that should be busted. Right now, it's all right. It's not bad, but it's like, damn, I want to go back to New York because I know this shit hit different. Oh look, yeah, energy, nigga. That's good energy right there. He gonna be like, you back with the camera? Yeah, man. Um, I just want to get a beer, but I'll say this, you know when the pizza is good, when you can get it by the slice. I don't know if it's like that in LA, but in Atlanta you can't get by the slice. But yeah, we about to just go ahead and have us a drink real quick. I had a pizza earlier, like I said, y'all probably won't be able to hear me, but... What is this? This uh, barbecue chicken, cheese. You got it. The cheese pizza gonna tell you, I don't even need it. I had a margarita slice. If you can't do a margarita right, that shit not good. First bite in. It has the crunch of a New York pizza and the size and the shape, the bowl. It doesn't have the taste. Even down to the crust, like, I was like, yo, even down to the crust, this feels authentic. But then you taste that shit and it's like, what? I'm on my second slice. This is the barbecue slice, right? The cheese was like, eh, and the barbecue is getting better. So I'm at the green. My man's seven out of ten on this spot. Not bad, not great. Good crunch, but definitely like if you were to pull up like kind of wavy, kind of drunk, and you just need some substance 
I'm not bad at all. Give me a slice, keep rolling out. Walk out, put it on a paper plate, and keep it moving. Uh, that's definitely a good review for sure. I agree with that. Everything you said, like I said earlier, I agree with it. On a good day, 7 out of 10. However, I'll give it like a 0.5 because it closes at 2.30 in the morning. And where I stay right now, nothing's open at 2.30 in the morning. You don't get food by like 10 o'clock. It's really 9, but really 10 o'clock. If you don't have food by 10 o'clock, you plan on eating out, you're select, like, you're assed out, bro. You about to pay for some shit that you don't want. Like, you might as well cook at home, like, yeah. at that point. Alright, it's nighttime right now. Everything just picked up. This shit went crazy just now. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna set expectations. It's not necessarily like New York, but this shit is a vibe. This shit is a vibe for sure. It's like, it's like perfect. Yeah, that's why I said earlier, it's like a cleaner Nola, like, it's a little cleaner. But, um, yeah, I wonder if, like, niggas should go to the block party shit that I sent you. Oh, yeah, it, that's uh, nice. But, yeah, that's on the other side, though, like, by the airport. By the airport, though. I remember one time to my crib, it's 20 minutes. It was at, like, 11.50 at night. That shit was $90. I'm like, what? Yeah, hell nah. A 20-minute drive? That's crazy, like. <laughs> So now I just be paying for parking at the airport. Yep. It's way cheaper. Yep, nigga. It's way cheaper. That's what I did today. Yep. What the fuck is over there? Show That's what I'm trying to figure out. With glow yeah, sticks and shit. Out. Yeah. What's in here? See mad black people in here. Trip. Yeah, that's what I had to do earlier. I'm like, damn, battery? Fuck. I need to cop like two more batteries. Cop like two more. I definitely ain't bring a uh, Yeah, this pizza no good. Yeah, that shit don't look bad, bro. It's not a soul in that bitch. <laughs> oh, there's Ain't nobody in there. there. <laughs> <laughs> we got the right pizza. <laughs> that that pizza probably don't got the right crunch. None of that. Like. No, he, he gonna heat up a pizza that that's like uh, that he made an hour ago. <laughs> Central. Huh? Let me look at the map. Be on my Magellan shit. Central. You are here. Where are you? Yeah, I'm about Where to say this is? ain't Central, but like it should be a you are here. Yeah. I feel like we came from this way. I don't know none of these shit. Okay, we, we are dead center though. That's that's yeah. good. My boys. <laughs> They're trying to deceive you. They're trying to deceive us. Alright. Okay, when when is that uh what's your call that that's that joint uh start? Now? Oh for real? Yeah. Good about it. Yeah, I feel like nothing good happens on Bourbon Street at night. Like, nothing good. You just be outside looking over your shoulder the whole time, like. And then you got that voodoo feel. Yeah. Just hanging over your head, like. It's a weird feeling, y'all. Nah, let out crazy. Tell these niggas what the let out looks like. I might move to Tampa, boy. Shit. The way let out looking like. Let out crazy right now. What I say niggas is dead, niggas is dead, bro. This shit is crazy. Let out crazy. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, bro. Let out crazy. That's facts. Let out is gonna be right now. Yeah, yeah. Niggas try to kick us out the let out because we taking their bitches, bro. Niggas try to kick us out of let out like we don't live this way. Wait. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. That's the baby. That's the baby on the fire truck, you heard? They got these shits on 44. Where the horses at? At this point, like, where the horses at? Like, just bring the horses outside. You know what's funny? When I was in Houston, niggas was outside with no horses, nigga. I was like, yeah. I got a bear. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm not going front. Because I've been in LA for bad long. Yeah. There's some thick joints out here. Like, I ain't seen no thickness like this in a minute. I'm not even going front. Thick. Nah, I mean, I might have a lot, Atlanta been spoiling me. To the point where I'm like, swine? I don't know anymore, like. Nigga, I, man, I want some skinny shit. Yeah. Like. Right. Oh, good, good. Yeah. Go ahead, cook. Yeah, 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 hey, 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 hey. Nah, 
Alright, you two about to be late. <laughs> Tampa, nigga? Yeah. Yeah, nigga. Alright.